Hi, this is Kevin Purcell for Notebooks.com, and I wanted to show you the new screen resizing tools in Lion. Now, before Lion came out, uh, all Macintosh computers with OS X, um, Snow Leopard, and earlier had a, a really annoying feature, and that was the only way to resize a window was to go down here in the corner like this. And now I came from the Windows area, and uh, over there in Windows, you know, we could grab any side, any corner, and resize things. So this was one of the, the little annoyances that I had, and, and I just couldn't understand it, and I'd ask people, why is that so? And they would always jokingly say, well, that's the way Steve Jobs wants it. But fortunately, with uh, Lion, that's no longer the case. You can still, of course, grab down here, but now you can grab on this side, take the corner up here, and, of course, when you take the corners, you're doing two sides at the same time. But if you add some shortcut keys, then it's really cool. For example, if you add the um, shift key to your resizing, notice how you maintain the aspect ratio of that window. So shift keeps aspect ratio. Now if you hit the option key, then what happens is not only is the edge that you are grabbing resized, but the opposite edge as well. So for example, if I want to make this taller, notice how it grabs both, changes both sides. So option resizes opposite. Easy to remember, option and opposite. Now what happens if you put the two together? Well, let's see. See, it does the whole thing. It, not only does it do opposites, but it also maintains the aspect ratio. So that's one of the cool new things about Lion, and it makes uh, window resizing a whole lot better. What I still wish you could do is what you can do in Windows, and that is drag a window to one side. Now, I've got a little program here called Cinch, and uh, Cinch does that. Notice how it takes it, and of course I've got a dual monitor, so it doesn't work on the the right side unfortunately because of that but that's one thing that I wish that they would have added as well in cinch I can go full screen like that but uh, that's something that Lion still needs to add and that Windows already has this has been Kevin Purcell for notebooks.com thank you for watching